Mount Hood holds many secrets. It is a repository of human history in Oregon. Since the beginning of humans in Oregon, more than 20,000 years ago, Mount Hood has been the lifeblood for human survival. With its forests, its rivers and lakes, and the abundance of fish and wildlife, Mount Hood provided everything that Oregon's indigenous people needed to prosper. In the recent past, Mount Hood was the homeland of many Indian tribes. They called the mountain Y East. Walk the trails of Mount Hood today and you likely will be walking on a trail used by indigenous people for thousands of years. The Sandy River Trail to Ramona Falls likely was an important route for indigenous people. The headwaters of the Sandy are on Mount Hood and it flows to the Columbia River. This provided a direct route from the Willamette Valley to the west side of Mount Hood for summer camps to hunt, fish, and collect plants and berries. Ramona Falls Trail is an easy seven mile loop. The trail slowly climbs as it follows the Sandy River. The trail drops down to the river and we hike in the stream channel. We had to cross the sandy to continue onto the Ramona Falls Trail. We find the log bridge and safely cross. From here, the trail climbs along the Sandy River Canyon we reach a plateau and get spectacular views of Mount Hood. We go around the bend and walk into a grotto of large trees and there is Ramona Falls. Flowing water seems to glow from within as it gently splashes down the black basalt. This place has a sense of calm and peacefulness. Being here is soothing and relaxing. Sit. Breathe. Listen. Feel the ancient history of this place. Refreshed, we leave Ramona Falls and wind our way back down the trail. We marvel at the beauty and diversity of nature that is Mount Hood. As the hike nears its end, I think to myself, why East holds the secrets of the nearly 1,000 generations of Oregonians that came before me.